Good morning. Welcome to a daily devotional for you. My name is Jade Mendoza, and we're going to be turning in our Bibles to 2 Timothy 3, 10 through 17. But thou hast fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, faith, long-suffering, charity, patience, persecutions, afflictions, which came unto me at Antioch and Iconium and Lystra, Lystra. What persecutions I endured, but out of them all the Lord I delivered me. The Lord delivered me. Yea, all that will live godly in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecution. But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. But continue thou in the things which thou hast learned and hast been assured of knowing of whom thou hast learned them. And that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures which are able to make thee wise unto salvation, through faith which is in Christ Jesus. All scripture is given by inspiration of God, and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good works. Today we're going to be reading about guidance. I went hiking with some friends not long after I graduated from high school. We went to a secluded area to do some st stargazing while there we heard some kind of wild animal growl in the woods. And it sounded like it was pretty close by too. That ended the stargazing expedition, but we still had to get back out of the woods to our car. I think we had some flashlights along, but it didn't seem like we had enough light. The path was rocky, steep, and we wanted to get out quickly. <clears throat> Life is a lot more dangerous than just encountering a wild animal growling in the woods after dark. Life is just, life is spiritually dangerous. 1 Peter 5, 8 says, Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. The devil is an enemy of God and our souls, and he wants to do as much damage as possible. Psalms 119, 105 says, that word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. The Bible is the source of truth and it can inform and guide us through life if we submit to God's teachings. The Bible is readily available to all of us. You can read it on your phone, listen to it being read, and there's tons of good material available electronically and in print to help you understand and apply it to your life. Life is dangerous. There are forces at work that want to ruin your life. Use the light of God's word as your safe and trustworthy guide. Basically, this tells you that you need to follow the guidance of God's word or else you would be misled or in worse trouble that you wouldn't want to be. So the point of this is to be with God and follow his word and to listen to him. Thank you for joining us every noon. Please join us again tomorrow at 8.05 a.m.